So my name is Jessica Udi. Um, I actually was invited to the very first service that Sojo held at the elementary school. Um, some of the church planters that were helping Corey were um, my customers and uh, invited me and I was like, you know what, why not? Let's just go see what this is about. And that was the beginning. <laughs> Still here. <laughs> you just feel this overwhelming sense of like, being welcomed, like fitting in, um, I don't know what the right word is, but even at that point, I think we call them door holders, yeah. you know, and like you're immediately hugged and greeted and it just felt so at home. And I think that's, that was what was different for me. Um, definitely made you want to come back for sure. Favorite moment for me would have to be Christmas of last year. Um, I mean, just seeing it beginning to now, right? Like, so in a cafeteria, you know, folding chairs, adding a few chairs when it gets a little crowded, right? Then to online for COVID, Papa Rob's, which was super cool, all the honking and amens and all that stuff. But to be in this building and for it to be full of 300 people praising at the same time, like, it just doesn't get any better than that. Our family has been through a lot in the last few years, and uh, I said I wasn't gonna cry, so I'm gonna, but without Sojo, I don't know that we could have gotten through it. Um, just the support, the prayers, the check-ins, the, I mean, even now, almost two years later, just how are y'all doing? Is everything, everybody good? Uh, you don't get that anywhere else. My dream for Sojo is seeing these other locations come to life. Um, you know, China Grove, I can't remember the, Harrisburg, but just to think of this in other places, to think of having this safe place in other communities, uh, I think it's incredible and I can't wait to be a part of it.